welcome to this channel in this tutorial I am going to create and run a simple .NET application using command prompt in Windows machine if you are new to this channel subscribe this channel to get more tutorials let's get started first all of ensure that you have installed dotnet sdk on your system first all of ensure that you have installed dotnet sdk on your system with this command dotnet hyphen hyphen version if you get this error dotnet is not recognized as an internal or external command you have to add system environment path variable after installing dotnet sdk on your system you will find a link in video description how to install dotnet sdk dotnet runtime and asp dotnet core now i am going to set up dotnet environment path variable copy this path and then open system environment variables from control panel click on this path and then edit now add a new path variable okay Now reopen command prompt and verify hyphen hyphen version ok. Now I am going to create a simple dotnet console application on desktop ok. Now I am going to create console application with this command so .NET new console this command will create a simple .NET console application and then use the parameter or then enter the application name the parameter hyphen o will create a directory my app where your dotnet console application will be stored now hit enter okay now navigate to your newly created application and see the directory structure with directory command okay now i am going to run this application with this command dot net run then it will print a message hello world ok now I am going to change this program open programs dot cs file with any text editor in this case a notepad and then type programs.cs then hit enter ok now update this code console dot right line here I am going to print a message the current time ok date time dot now ok now save this file and run again with this command don't use parenthesis ok 
now run and you will see hello world and another message the current time is if you like this video like comment and share thank you so much for watching this video